Did one of us pass games still need your stuff? No, because I haven't started the game yet. guys and welcome to the video and hopefully new series. Uh, for some reason I'm always obsessed with going to options. Uh, okay, yep, show subtitles and f f that should be it. Anyway, uh, this is the first time I've ever played Medieval and it's just, like I know nothing about it except for, well, what has happened and the fact that the main character does have the bottom half of his jaw. So when the remake was announced, I was excited because I was curious to start this. So with that in mind, let's start. <laughs> it's almost good when the loading cursor thingy laughs at you, huh? Okay, yeah, <laughs> Meanwhile, back back where the cutscene was. Oh. Okay, correct me if I'm wrong, but shouldn't the rust have the armor have rust gotten all rusty? To be fair, was that for his jaw or his left eye? Yeah. <coughs> I'm back. <laughs> Dan's crept. Rise and shine, Dan. Looks like you've got a second chance at this whole hero thing. Try not to fuck it up. <laughs> Basically. It has risen again. Sir Daniel uh, Fortescue, what? see? Fortescue. The uncle of Gallomere who fell at the first charge. The fog of war and the shrouds of time conspire to turn the arrow fodder into the savior of the day. It was one arrow. It's better. Yeah, you go to sleep. Let it alone. Ah, uh, why are there more? Given it a second chance. A chance to forget the ignoble truth. A chance to defeat Sarak and live up to the legend. We hope it does well. Kind of golem like, isn't it? Okay, good. So, first off, I am brand new at this game, and so far it looks good, and... Oh! <laughs> I forgot, man, like... Oh, God, God, I'm recording the audio way differently to the gameplay. Like, <laughs> I forgot that I could use... I... You must your first weapon is... His, his arm. On your back. Use the crypt to get you say... With your you say that. Uh, I say that sounds like a terrific way to spend life. <laughs> Just laying on your back doing nothing. Read the books and dance crowd to learn the basics. Alright. <laughs> Boomerang and. Ooh, camera angles. Uh, uh, let's go back in. Oh. Money! Okay, so I'm guessing if anything, uh, going back to dance crypt may be good if you're wanting to some cash. Ooh. Uh, okay, I've got my arm and and the book. Heh, only when disarmed. That's bad on several levels. Okay, so I can have a primary and a secondary weapon. 
What? Wait, what's the bottle in the background? Um. <laughs> right now I'm just uh, basically just just exploring. And hello, found the life bottle. Little did I know at that point, for those were would be unbelievably important in the game. You will find life bottles throughout Galamir. <laughs> Already did. The same magic that rose you from your slumber and will raise And that's why they're so useful. Again. When your life is low, using this bottle will help you feel a little better. And remember to fill it when you can. Oh, I oh I end up doing that now, believe me. When you're ready More to books. read this script, you'll find an exit at the end of the hall. To unlock the gates, you must find a room stone and place it in the ornate hand set next to the door. I mean, I've heard of elaborated lock mechanisms before, but surely that just takes the cake. <laughs> uh, I've got a left boomerang. Okay. <laughs> Did discover just discovered crouching. Uh, yeah, and let's read the book. Any treasure that you find will be added to your coin total. Coins are used to buy items from the greedy merchant gargoyles. All right. So I'm guessing I'm guessing I just come across more gargoyles. Open chest. Ah. <laughs> so ah, I've actually got a a, pro a proper weapon now. Yay! <laughs> Some weapons contain powers and abilities beyond the ordinary. Be sure to test every weapon to discover the. Other than video game logic abilities. and maybe magic. Some How? weapon abilities are immediate, and some may need a bit of time to charge before they realize uh, their full potential. That's so true with swords. Person holds out to charge a weapon. Ah, three daggers at once. Uh, okay. Okay, found the rune. And, uh, oh, shiny. <laughs> okay, X to jump. Well, that's kind of basic gaming, isn't it? Ah, uh, excuse me. Open, open, open the chest. Yeesh. Hey, I found me a shield. <laughs> okay. Uh, no, 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 play with the ca camera again. Book! During your travels through Galamir, oh, you that's right. many items. To see your items or to use one, review your inventory. In it, you will also find your Book of Galamir, which will keep a record of the denizens you've encountered and bestow you with keen insights that only a disembodied voice could provide. <laughs> only in Galamir. Oh. Wait, is that how you even pronounce it? Probably not. Press button to open inventory. <gasps> it's so full up now. <laughs> as a, as opposed to two, like, like what, ten seconds ago? Okay, maybe not in exactly ten seconds, but still. Uh... Okay, you need to go copper shield, star rune, book. Let's check out the book, book real quick. Sir Daniel Me. Random earthworm. Friend, <laughs> uh, under friendlies. For so happy when Dan. Was so happy when Dan died, surely he. Yeah, he had a lot of housework to do, but he's got the place to himself now, <laughs> and just how he he likes it. So what? He's like a roommate or something? Can you imagine how boring it would be to be a sentient being, wise even, and be stuck permanently to a brick wall? No wonder these guys are grumpy. They pass time by eavesdropping, gossiping, and bad-mouthing any bizarre-looking adventures that might pass by. <laughs> Bizarre's an understatement with this guy. Zarok. I feel like I'm gonna mistake... I, f I feel like I'm gonna say Zavok instead of Zarok a lot. It is said that Zarok's preoccupation with necromancy stems from an obsession to resurrect oh, his God. childhood puppy. <sighs> Let's just reflect for a moment. Isn't that just tragic? 
All this poor troubled soul has ever wanted is to command the forces of darkness, enslave mankind, and play ball one last time with dear old Mr. Snuffy. Mr. Snuffy? Seriously? So, to say Mr. Snuffy got snuffed would be kind of an understatement. And perhaps I ironic. Uh, I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> forgetting that. Because I see a sword. I, I found a small sword. <laughs> Yikes, fat. Nearly, nearly one, swing it hard. Okay. I've got no weapons that aren't my arm. Which I can't help but think is maybe a little bit ironic considering how you actually get a trophy for killing something with just using just your arm. Actually, if anybody you get two trophies, he's one of them's for beating a boss just by throwing your arm a lot. I end up getting it. I end up getting that, but not on video. Or either that, or I just don't have it saved. I don't actually remember it, to be honest. Anyway, more books. Track down Zerok. By retracing his diabolical odyssey through Galomir, you can spot the exits from an area by looking out for his stinking trail. I can't help but really wonder where that was going with the whole thing. Look out for his stinking trail of magic slime. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> I don't know. But anyway, I think that's the level. <laughs> that, yep, that's the level in a nutshell, yes. Uh, so where off to next? Hm. Uh, <laughs> uh, looks like we are off to the graveyard. Wait, uh, what? Uh, <laughs> okay, I can go to Dan's Crypt or the graveyard. Uh, you, you know, <laughs> you know, let's just jump into it. <laughs> 